we're going to watch a movie called The Cold, otherwise known as The Game, directed by Bill Rabane on this uh, 50 movie pack chilling classics. Let's watch. We're introduced to the game. And the three millionaires have invited nine people. For the third time, Horace. There are two young men, one Jonathan Walker and the other one, Joel uh, Coletto. Now there's also a very intelligent young lady, a law student, might I add. The big prize is a million dollars. Whoever can stay in this mansion or hotel or wherever they are the longest will win the million dollars. It's clear they're going to be scared. Here's two of the babes. The one on the right is named Shelly. Yep, you're seeing this right. One of the things they're doing is putting a shark in the swimming pool to scare her away. Obviously not a real shark, I guess. There's this guy wandering around the halls, and all of a sudden... I believe that's the guy who just got attacked in the hallway. I'm not sure how to describe this scene. I believe this guy's name is Aaron. I don't know where he stumbled into. But it looks like a crypt or something. With bars and a mattress. And a skeleton. It's like these millionaires have created a fun house. Doesn't seem that scary to me, though. I guess what's playing on the TV? Another Bill Rabane classic. Now this one I can't explain. Later on, our three millionaires in mask tie up Shelly. For what reason? I don't know yet. Well, apparently all they wanted to do was stick a sock in her mouth and leave her there. And dance in the hallways again. Another woman takes a swim. This time there's a snake in the pool. Although it's hard to tell if this is actually happening or is this a dream the woman is having. I'm not sure. Because while she screams, in the next scene we see her in the bed. Here's that same woman who's in the pool. Open the door for God's sakes. Remember Shelly was left with a sock in her mouth? Apparently she's dead now. That's the guy who was in the sauna with her earlier. Thing away. You're 
make every rule of the game, Bob. It's true, young Dean. You bastards killed my girl. Kelly. Scum. Oh, he knew his business now. He shot Horace. Anyway, after shooting Horace, he runs off. Followed closely by the other guy. Eventually, he catches up with him. They claim that the three aren't dead. Or however many are worth. More than that. All the while, this cold air has been coming in all over the place, too, hence the title of the movie The Cold. Cold and now it's now seeping in everywhere, and our millionaires are trying to evade the cold. I don't know how it happened, but somehow our three millionaires are now frozen solid in the steam room. No explanation as to how they got there or why they froze to death. Or did they? And that's how our ridiculous movie ends. Alright, let's talk about this movie called The Cold, otherwise known as The Game. I have it on one of these uh, 50 uh, movie pack chilling classics here. Um, that's where I first saw this movie. I saw it about 2012, I think, six years ago, and I'm seeing it again. Um, I reviewed it on my previous channel, and I'm redoing it, so there you go. Um, it's uh, directed by the great Bill Rabane, who um, directed a lot of uh, low-budget movies, uh, mostly in Wisconsin. I'm not sure if he's uh, living... I think he lives in Wisconsin, actually. He did the great Giant Spider Invasion, or was that the Great Spider Invasion? Giant Spider Invasion, 1975. Um... He did Monster of Go-Go, Demons of Ludlow, uh, you name it, low budget, he was in involved with it. I think he did Rana, Secret of uh, Shadow Lake also. And um, all of these movies, I believe, were filmed in northern Wisconsin, uh, which is where I'm talking to you right now from. Um, <laughs> this movie, again, I, I don't know where these people come from. They're very low budget, low budget actors. I I'm guessing they were all friends and people he knew around the state of Wisconsin who just uh, volunteered to be in this movie. Not great acting. But it's this film has a really weird atmosphere to it, which I kind of like. It's kind of, I don't know if creepy is quite the word for it, but it's just kind of, I don't know, strange. It just kind of harkens back. Uh, I, it's hard to put a finger on it, what exactly it is about this movie. I mean, it's not a good movie by any means, but it entertained me on some sort of level. I don't know. Perhaps I'm just thinking of my childhood. This film was made in the, in the early 80s, 19, in, in, in 1984, I think this came out, 83 maybe. And that was... Um, I spent a lot of time in northern Wisconsin during that time when I was a kid. Uh, my grandparents lived up there. And I don't know, something about just the, the mood, the atmosphere just takes me back to that time. So maybe it's nostalgic for me. I don't know. Anyway, we got a bunch of people in this house. They've been invited. Kind of reminds me of um, House on Haunted Hill a little bit. Uh, we have three millionaires uh, who are giving away a million dollar prize to anybody who can last the longest in this. It's, I think it's supposed to be a mansion, but it was actually filmed at a hotel uh, up up in uh, near Three Lakes, Wisconsin. Um, and they just try to scare them, basically, and, until they leave. And a few people end up dying, or we're not sure if they actually did die or not. Um, it's hard to tell. And at the last scene, it just kind of got really weird at the end. We see the last scene, the people are like frozen, but then they're alive. And I don't know what's going on, to be honest with you. But I don't know. It's kind of entertaining on a bad level. Um, there is a couple of nude scenes in this, too, which actually surprised me, considering these are probably people who aren't like 
real actors. They're just people <laughs> that the director may have known. Uh, but there's a full frontal nude scene from one of the women as well. So that was kind of cool. So anyway, check this out. It's called The Game, a.k.a. The Cold. Um, I have it on here as The Cold. Don't know if it's available on a, an individual DVD, although I think it is, but it's probably not. Probably just as cheap as this one is. Not the greatest quality, but hey, what can you do, right? So check it out. Let me know what you think about it. Leave some comments down below. Spill remains The Cold. Watch it. Bye.